My name is Nate Patterson. I'm a uh, marketing major here at uh, Andrews University. This is my first year, and I shouldn't be alive. Sports and athletics were just such a major part of uh, my growing up. I was always playing sports, whether it was soccer, basketball. Um, this is really important to me, and I was at the height of my physical ability um, going into my freshman year of high school. And uh, I'd been training all summer to make uh, varsity. I'd been uh, uh, going to conditioning practices all summer, went to two basketball camps, and uh, was running an uh, under seven minute mile. And uh, the first day of school, um, I went to a practice uh, that night, and um, it was a normal practice. I ran suicides, and uh, I went, um, and I went home, went to bed, and said goodnight to my parents, and then uh, didn't wake up the next morning. So around 4 a.m. that night, uh, my brother woke up to hearing me breathe really agonally. And uh, so he went in and got my parents, uh, told them that uh, Nate wasn't breathing right. And they came in and I just altogether stopped breathing. And so my dad started doing CPR and my mom called 911. Uh, and the paramedics arrived. Um, and then uh, they couldn't get me, couldn't get um, me breathing there at the house. They had to take me into the local hospital. Uh, still couldn't get me stable. And then they airlifted me to um, a more central hospital all the time trying to trying to get me breathing again. And uh, um, twice on the helicopter, they almost lost me completely. Um, they finally got uh, my heart back into rhythm by giving it a shot of magnesium. And, uh, and then they put me in a medically induced coma and basically told my parents that I probably would never wake up and that I would um, just be brain dead for the rest of my life. They found out that uh, I had had a heart attack in the middle of the night. Um, they had no idea why or um, had no idea of predicting it. It just happened. And um, at that moment, I had zero control over my life. Um, miraculously, uh, seven days later, I was back on my feet and walking around almost as if nothing had happened, um, which they were saying I was going to need to go to rehab for three months. But um, and just a week later, I was um, physically um, pretty much OK, other than the fact that I had a very extremely rare unclassified heart disease. So many people um, uh, prayed for me throughout that event, and uh, I owe my life totally and completely to God, even, even though um, there's a lot about it that I still struggle with. God still has used um, my story to bring other people to him.